Aaron Morris lost his car, but was able to get back what was most valuable to him. Mama! Jolene! His beloved dog. Little Jolene was abandoned in another state, but now she's finally home. <laughs> This little cutie's name is Limbani, and he is more than happy to see his adoptive parents. <laughs> they haven't seen each other in three years. Let's give them a minute. Watch this wild lioness turn into a playful kitten at the sight of the man who saved her many years ago. This boy burst into tears, but not because he wanted this kind of gift for a long time. This is his lost pug, Piper, who was given to him when his brother lost his battle to cancer. <laughs> this young man's dog was also lost, and he'd already given up hope of seeing him again. Who says boys don't cry? <laughs> if you think rabbits don't feel affection, then look at how little Beanie greets his owner, Shy, after a very long vacation. Wait here. <laughs> you two are unbelievable. And now, watch how Smokey runs as fast as he can to say thank you to the vet who saved his life and rehabilitated him for two long months after a terrible fire. A volunteer named Miro and the monkey he saved from starvation can only see each other once a year when the circus comes to town. But each of their reunions is simply priceless. <laughs> Oh, well, look at him. He's kissing you. A schnauzer named Casey hasn't seen the person she loves most in two long years. No wonder she was so overjoyed that she even fainted. <laughs> Is she okay, by the way? Everything's fine with her, though. No worries. <laughs> This lion clearly had plans until suddenly he heard the voice of his owner who he hadn't seen for ages. <laughs> and the meeting of these two is more than just a reunion. Attila is an old U.S. Marine dog and was preparing to live out his days at the shelter after retirement. But his old partner, Jacob Barella, fought for three years for the right to take the dog home and won. So that's good. Careful, lady. Looks like you're being attacked by an angry goose. Just kidding. In fact, this goose had just been really missing his owner, Cindy, and this is how he expressed his emotions. Camels never forget anything. See for yourself. This one recognizes its owner amongst a group of people, and now it won't let him go. Here's proof that dogs aren't the only ones who look forward to their owners coming home. And that's the cat's reaction to his daddy after a short business trip. This man had been in the army for six months, and this is the first thing he did when he came home. Oh my god! Oh my god! It's like his dog is telling him all about what happened while he was gone. I know. A German shepherd named Psycho was still a puppy when its owner went into the service. A year later, she sees a stranger at her door, but after a second of sniffing, they're best friends again. At least the dog knows how to redirect that excitement. Dean Schneider hasn't seen his family for two and a half weeks, and this is how they're happy to have him back. That's right, I'm talking about these lions, because four years ago, this man sold his company in Zurich to become a part of their pride in South Africa. 
This deaf dog can't hear his owner at all, but that doesn't stop him from telling her how much he missed her. They had been growing up together for 13 years, so being apart for three months was very hard for him. Too cute. Oh, yeah. This is how this man calls his pet, and it's clear from the response he gets that this is not a dog at all. Derek has been with these elephants since they were babies, and now, many years later, they consider him one of them. Right after a vacation, this girl went straight to visit her best friend. Fortunately, her horse Lucky Hoof doesn't react as roughly as my friend does when he sees me in the mall. Oh, look how tender they are to each other. Little Zoe hadn't seen her grandma for a whole week, and this is how she reacted to seeing her. <laughs> yeah, of course I was talking about a baby monkey. What do you think? When this man's dog disappeared three days ago, he never suspected he would find his little Mitzi in a foxhole. <laughs> This man was just going to feed his swan, Kesha, but he couldn't hold back the swan's gratitude. And this is two and a half years after the poor thing was rescued from poachers. This baby elephant is so happy to see the woman who took care of him at the zoo that he can't stop kissing her. Still don't believe that elephants can love just like humans? As you know, cheetahs are ferocious enough to rip a gazelle in half. Boy Gabe, hey buddy! Hey, buddy, remember me? Good boy Gabe. But not this purring cutie named Gabriel. The two met a year earlier and haven't seen each other since, but the wild animal immediately recognized its friend. You're a good boy, Gabe. You're a good boy. It's heartbreaking that this dog doesn't recognize her owner at all. Paquita was lost three years ago and ended up in a shelter, but now her daddy has found her and she finally figures it out. Limbani <laughs> was born with pneumonia and his own mother abandoned him, so Tanya and George decided to raise the chimpanzee as their own child. He will always remember that. This man's cat disappeared right before he moved to Ohio seven years earlier. He still can't believe that his 19-year-old pet was found years later right at their old house. Oh, here he comes. Here he comes. <laughs> oh. Watch as Damien Aspinall calls out to his old friend with hope. He raised a gorilla named Kiabi and released him into the wild five long years ago. But Kiabi recognized the voice of this person and doesn't want to let him go again. I'm gonna get out of here. And that's all. What's the longest you've ever been apart from your pet? Be sure to write in the comments about how they greeted you. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell if you want to see part two. See you later.